can't hear the desktop audio in OBS even though your microphone's working fine? Are you ready to give up and quit because you knew that being a YouTuber was just a pipe dream? Well, fear not, because I'm here to tell you that you can hear the desktop audio in OBS if you listen to my awesome steps. But the YouTuber thing, yeah, that might not work out. I don't have a good intro, yeah. So before we begin, a good question we need to ask ourselves is, how do we even know if we have desktop audio issues in OBS in the first place? It's a good question and could save you time in watching this video to the end. So to know if we have desktop audio issues, here are some common symptoms. You can't hear the desktop audio in OBS, either while you're recording or during the playback of your recording. That is the number one sign of desktop audio issues in OBS. So if that sounds like you, keep watching. Some other less known but equally important symptoms of desktop audio issues in OBS include, but are not limited to, despair, frustration, and hopelessness on not being able to solve this problem that is seemingly easy and a two-year-old with an iPad could do it. But fear not, there is hope. We're going to solve these issues right now as best we can. So here's how I solved my issues and how you may be able to solve them as well. Go here to the bottom in your search bar and type in sound settings or just type in sound because you're lazy. Open it and check out your input and output. I already have my input set to my USB microphone, which is the Samsung Go mic in this case. My output originally was also set to the Samsung Go mic and this is a no-no. Why? I'll show you why. Let us test this theory. Right now, I have both the output and input on the Samsung Go mic. This is how it was originally set up and the reason why I couldn't hear my desktop audio. Oh, who is she? Just ignore that. Anyways, here is Tranquility. Now, I don't know about you, but I cannot hear any of this. And that is terrible because if I can't hear it, that means I can't do my job as a tutorialist or whatever I am and tell you guys how to hear this correctly. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna pause this, go back and fix this. Make sure your output is set to the default, which in my case is speaker Realtek audio and conveniently the only other option I have. So I click on that and now it should work. Let's go test it to make sure it works. La -dee -da -dee -da. Beautiful. Sounds like beautiful, Free for profit use, chill lo-fi beats. Stuff of dreams. And if your desktop audio still isn't working, you might wanna just go here to the settings, click properties, and make sure it's on your default. Default being either the word default or your actual default that you picked for your output when we were doing the sound settings. Do not select your USB microphone. That's when problems happen. Click OK to save the changes. Make sure the mic properties are all up and running. Your microphone should be set to your USB microphone or whatever external microphone you're using. Click OK and that should resolve everything. So now that we fixed it there, we should be done, right? Wrong. You still could be experiencing desktop audio issues. If you followed all the steps I provided just now and that still doesn't work, then you want to go to these handy dandy troubleshoot buttons and make sure that your sound's working fine. The troubleshoot button may not appear here on your computer because of your model of computer. Different computers have different sound settings, but ultimately you want to make sure you troubleshoot your audio so that way you're able to figure out if it's a problem within OBS or your computer itself. So troubleshoot that sucker, and if it still doesn't work after that, then I'm sorry, but you have no other option but to throw your computer away. Just get rid of it. You don't want it anymore. It's useless. And I'm so sorry it had to come to this, but it's just what must be done. But in all seriousness, each computer model is different. And while my tutorial may have been a quick fix for me because, well, I'm using my own computer, it may not work for you, especially if you're on an Apple device, because those things are way different than PCs. However, you will encounter these problems along the way. OBS has BS in the name for a reason, in that you will encounter some BS problems. But it's up to you, the innovative, creative individual, who is not necessarily the most technologically savvy or smart person in, on the planet, but is determined to find solutions. And that is all. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.